In your experience, what do prep school coaches and D1 coaches or any college coach, what do they want to see in a highlight tape? They want to see competitiveness. They want to see toughness. Obviously, you know, the game is called basketball. We want to see shot making, you know, and, and, and not a season when your highlight film shows you're making six threes. You know, if you're a three-point shooter, there should be a lot of three-point shots on that on that video. If the best thing about you is you're a great defender, put highlight clips of you really guarding someone. Find someone in your league that's supposed to be a great player and show how you locked them up and don't say, oh, when we played such and such, he had 10 points. I held him to 10 points. And then I look at the film, you didn't guard him. Your team guard him. You didn't individually guard him and hold him to 10 points. So we're looking for all that stuff. And obviously, talent, size, length for your position. You know, Isaiah Thomas, when I had him here, obviously he's small, but he has six foot three wingspan. You know, so he was small, but he made up for it with the length and the size of his hands. So the really good evaluators are looking at all those different metrics. Gotcha. But is there anything you want a kid to include or not include in a highlight tape? I don't want to hear a bunch of crazy music in the background. That stuff is distraction. You know, I oftentimes I hit silence or if it's so vulgar, I just turn it. I don't watch the kid, yeah. you know, um, and that's maybe not a knock against a kid. And maybe I miss a good kid, but coaches really don't have time for that. We want to see you play. Yeah. What are you doing between the lines? That's what we want to see.